You ain't got no gains. You ain't lift no weights. <laughs> So this is going to be one of the craziest tricep workouts that has probably ever been posted on YouTube. So of course, we got to fuel up with some superhuman burn. So this tricep workout only took me about 20 to 25 minutes, but holy shit, there are moves in here that are going to help you guys really build mass and it's going to make you really sore. So I was sore for about 48 hours after this workout. Now, the first move is an exercise that I believe Greg Doucette called it the most overrated or the worst tricep exercise. And you're gonna try to swing it back and you're gonna be swinging like this, okay? You're gonna be looking like you're dancing in a Chloe Ting video or something. And I would have to disagree because when you really do this move right and you incorporate a drop set, you get nothing on the eccentric part of the rep because gravity is just putting that dumbbell straight back down to the ground. But on the concentric portion, you really get a great contraction with heavy weight. So pick a weight that you could handle for eight to 10 reps, go until failure, and then drop the weight by about 30%. So I went from 30 pound dumbbells to 20 pound dumbbells and do eight to 10 more reps. So I, I call this an anabolic drop set just to really piss off the internet. But just basically you're picking a heavy weight for, that you can handle for eight to 10 reps. You're dropping the weight by about 30%. You're doing another eight to 10 reps. So I went two sets here, 75 second rest time. So the second tricep exercise went right to the cables, little underhand grip, tricep press down. Now my grip is slightly outside shoulder width apart on the outer ridges of an easy bar. And I like this move because I feel a good contraction on the long head, also the side of the triceps throughout every part of the rep. So on the eccentric part of the rep, when you're coming back towards your face, go pretty slow, two seconds, and then really focus on exploding on the concentric portion. You'll get a great contraction. Now I supersetted these with some close grip press downs. So these are close grip, elbows out, tricep press downs, of course, I got these from Charles Glass. They're in the five forgotten triceps exercise video. And this one's great because it's a little bit shortened range of motion, but you can go nice and heavy throughout the entire portion of the rep. So eight to 10 nice heavy reps. And this was a super set. So a drop set is the same exercise, just dropping the weight. A super set is two different exercises. So next up, I threw in two quick supersets of tricep press downs. So I switched my grip from an underhand grip position to an overhand grip position. And I'm focusing on locking my hands at the bottom of each rep. So just a little bit different contraction. And then once again, I'm supersetting here with the close grip tricep press down. Doing those two moves back to back was probably my favorite part of the workout. By far the biggest tricep pump that I had during the workout right after that last set. So next up, we're staying on the cable machine and we're doing rope tricep press downs. So on this move, really focus on rotating those knuckles around each other and then going back up slow and controlled. Just get a nice contraction. Just pay very close attention to the way that I'm rotating my hands in the video because that's truly the key to feeling the most out of this. So I love this move because you feel it a ton in the side of your triceps and go nice and heavy, fail in the 10 to 12 rep range here. So next up, we threw in one little set here of overhand grip rope triceps. So this move, it depends how tall you are on the starting position, but you're basically gonna start with the rope just a little bit above your head. You're gonna kneel forward and once again, you're focusing on stretching the long head and focusing on rotating those knuckles around each other. So another great move to really go heavy, but really control the weight the entire time with your triceps. So I recommend you go eight to 10 repetition range here. And then to end the workout, what we did here is some heavy dumbbell overhand grip triceps. So I would traditionally start my tricep workout with this move, 
but I decided to really just kind of pre-fatigue and then try the mass building move at the end of the workout. Really no science behind it. I just wanted to change it up and try something different. So I must say I really enjoyed the move because you can go really heavy on this move. So I think going heavy on this move is a lot more beneficial when you're already sort of pre-fatigued from other moves, like all the cable circuit moves that we did. So yeah, I ended there with two sets, eight to 10 rep range. And of course the arms every single day challenge is fueled by superhuman protein. So superhuman protein is the easiest and most delicious way to get in an extra 50 to 75 grams of the highest quality protein source on the planet. Also incredibly versatile. You can add it into brownies and a ton of epic recipes to get in that delicious protein throughout the day. So tap the link down below and use the code best protein ever for 25% off superhuman protein, sample tubs included. So this was episode number three. If you missed any of the first two episodes in the series, tap the link down below and I will see you guys on episode number four. You ain't got no games. You ain't got no weights.